Hey guys, it's General Heat here. How is everyone doing today? Uh, for those of you who are watching this video uh, when it first came out, well, Happy New Year. Uh, and during in the New Year, we are going to uh, show you guys a really uh, cool glitch that we found also on New Year's. <laughs> this happened like shortly after the ball dropped and we were just uh, playing some Halo 3. And as you can see, it is a super bounce. Now, you may be thinking, uh, how could it be a super bounce in Halo 3? There was never one previously. Well, that is kind of true, uh, and Halo 3 doesn't really have any super bounces, not like Halo 2, but there is one exception to that rule, and to do this super bounce, which you've already seen now, it's uh, really easy to do, but there are a couple steps that you need to take first, and uh, I'm quite positive it's going to be time sensitive as well, <laughs> unless you could like replicate the same conditions all the time. And what I mean by that is, this super bounce, it only happens when the game, or actually rather when the servers, Xbox Live servers at least, or MCC servers are really uh, laggy. And it's really laggy right now because it's, uh, it's still around the holidays, you know, everybody just, um, a lot of new people just got Xbox Ones and MCC for Christmas or something like that, and you know, everybody's playing it during their time off now. So lately, over the past few days, it's been really laggy online on pretty much any game, you know, Halo, Call of Duty, all that, it's, servers have been under a lot of stress lately. And with that uh, in mind, with this glitch, this happens because if you are the non-host of the game, if you're the host, this won't work for you at all, nothing will look different for you, but if you are the non-host, you can see that everything is really laggy, uh, and just simply standing in front of the wheel as it's spinning, uh, once it touches you and starts pushing you, uh, pretty quickly you'll get uh, you'll get bounced up and pretty much launched out the map as well uh, and yeah it's <laughs> that's really it. that's all you need to do <laughs> and it's like I said it's time sensitive so like at, usually after the holidays is when like Xbox live activity kind of like dies down a little bit and you know people people settle down a bit so um, once you know people get off it's you might not be able to replicate the conditions anymore to make this consistently laggy. Now, of course, if you have that one friend who has like such a bad connection that they're always laggy when uh, they're non-host or something like that, or when you're non-host, then maybe you could still get this to work. Um, I don't know if this works on the 360 version of Halo 3, um, but it definitely does work perfectly well on MCC version of Halo 3. And it works very consistently, too. We've managed to, like bounce him up or launch him up almost like 100% consistently just by standing there really and sometimes you could launch your body really really far out of the map uh, and such so yeah that's all you need to do just whoever wants to do the super launch or super bounce you just got to be um, non-host and around the holidays so if you're watching this future video in the future uh, if it's uh, if it's not around the holidays anymore and you know everything's fine and nothing's really laggy, you might not be able to do this anymore. But if this happens to still be a holiday uh, when you're watching this video, whether it's still you know recent or you know it's holiday of 2019 or whatever future holiday, um, then you know you might be able to do this again. Now you may be wondering since. Uh, the wheel is lagging. Does this work on other Halo games that also has the same map and the same wheel? And the answer is, yeah, it kind of does actually. But while it does work on other Halo games, it's kind of laggy. Um, not not laggy. It's um, it's not as laggy it seems. And when it when you when you get launched, it's it's a pretty weak launch. With Halo Three, you just got like f you get flung so fast sometimes that you instantly die when you hit something. Uh, but on Halo 2 Classic and even Halo 2 Anniversary, it just it just launches you forward a little bit, like uh, like a few feet forward sometimes. But it's not gonna like super bounce you out. It's just a small bump forward, I guess you could say. Um, but you know, at least it kind of works. But it works best on Halo 3, which is why I wanted to make this a most mostly a Halo 3 video. Um, but yeah, so there you guys have it. That is the. Uh, the <laughs> lag bounce, I guess if this should be called, really. Um, but it is still a super bounce because you do. It bounces you up and down on that, and I guess um, it bounces you enough that you get bounced really high up and really far out, and sometimes really fast uh, out of the map. And it, like I said, it works best on uh, Halo 3. 
but yeah, anyways, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, like this is our first video of the year, so um, got a lot of cool stuff coming out soon. Um, you know, some things to announce in the near future. So do stay tuned, and you know, as always, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, leave your thoughts in the comments. Uh, just anything you want me to check out or look into, or anything you want to see going forward into 2019, just let me know in the comments, and I'll do my best to look into it. But other than that, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys next time. Happy New Year again, and bye everybody.